Hi guys, um, just an update, it's um, well into December now, I think um, 16th of December, um, a little catch up on my pond and fry, um, so the fry were born in June, um, and I've put most of them outside now in the main pond, um, in my veggie filter, because I did buy a big tank, but the tank stayed in the garage, and I couldn't really afford to heat it in the garage, so... The fish, are, the fish are kind of on their own now, the baby fish out there. Um, I've kept five of the best ones in this tank. I'll show you those. So I think definitely more goldfish than koi. A um, couple of them with nice colours on. But yeah, not doing too bad. Uh, I know the tank is a bit small again. Um, I'm doing regular water changes. So, um, hopefully that'll be okay. Um, we'll take you out into the pond. Um, the idea of this video is basically to show you the reality of um, of, of, a, of a UK pond in the winter. Um, I'm not saying that you don't need to clean the filters and change the water, but um, I mean, I don't change my water or clean my filters. Um, I'll show you when we go out there. Um, it's a bit of a mess, um, to be, be fair, they'll, they'll be okay over the winter. Um, so I'll take you out to show you the pond now. So this is the state of the pond at the moment. Um, like I say, I don't change any of the water. Um, I just let rainwater make the changes. And obviously when I, when I clean my filter out, I top up with fresh water. Um, but I haven't cleaned my filter for probably four or five months now. Um, I'll show you around the back of the filter. Um, it's a mixture of not having the time to clean it and also the fact that I just don't think it needs cleaning. Um, I think the more you mess with these systems, the more trouble you're going to have. Um, the water's brown at the moment because there was quite a lot of leaves sat, in the, um, sat on the net on top, so all the tannins have gone in the water and made it a bit brown. Um, I'll show you around the back. So that's what my filter is looking like at the moment. Um, not actually looking very dirty on top. Um, I'm imagining in the sump underneath the, the base there'll be a lot of um, a lot of waste. But at the moment, it's not looking too bad. Like I say, I haven't actually um, cleaned it since the summer. Um, and there's my uh, overflow tank, uh, which I did have the babies in them. It's 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 got a thick layer of leaves at the bottom, um, and all the baby fish. There's probably about a hundred baby fish in there hiding in the leaves. Um, or they died in the cold, not really sure. Hopefully they're in the leaves, I'm pretty sure they are. More leaves in the veggie filter, just a uh, bit of a mess. <clears throat> the uh, pond window pond window is covered in algae. Um, see the water's very brown with the tannins. I think the fish are okay. I haven't seen any anyone that's got any issues yet. Trouble is, once you once you come out of winter into spring again, that's when you start to notice the um, the problems. So I may well have a good clear out in the spring. I might change a lot of the water. Maybe give it a PP clean. Um, but at the moment, I'm not really doing anything with it. I turned the skimmer off a, a, a long time ago um, because it was getting blocked quite a lot um, and the UV, all that's running at the moment is the main is the main pump from the Cetus sieve up into the multi-bay and uh, that small 20 watt air pump, that's all that's running at the moment. The sieve's pretty clean, haven't cleaned the sieve out for months either. Oh, there's a baby fish in there. See that? So somehow the baby fish are getting out of my out of my tank system into the pond. So I'll have to fish him out in a minute. Um, so yeah, the sieve hasn't been cleaned out for a long time. Multi bay hasn't been cleaned out for a long time, and I'm not I'm not saying that's um, the right thing to do. Um, but I just haven't got the time, and um, if I don't see any any ill effects of 
the low maintenance and I'll um, then I'll just continue um, in the summer I, I do like after it a bit better but I think in the winter it's just um, for my mind best just left alone um, so yeah that's that's the reality really I know lots of people have got lovely looking ponds 365 days a year um, but I just haven't got time I work full time I've got two kids I've got a, a big house to big house to look after and I just haven't got the time um, but yeah hope you've enjoyed this update and um, found it interesting and uh, there'll be more in the springtime thanks bye bye